food. Charleston was not far, but they did not often go there. No. I lived in Charleston, and sometimes I visited La Grande. I crossed the creek to the island in a small boat. William Le Grand was an interesting man who had a good education, but he was also a strange man. Le Grand enjoyed living in this quiet place because he did not like meeting people. Often, he did not speak for several days. Sometimes, he became excited and talked for many hours. When I visited Sullivan's Island, Le Grand and I talked about many things. We talked about books that he had read. He talked about the animals, birds, and insects near his home. He drew pictures of the creatures that he saw on the island.